Space Cable software optimizes the design and manufacture of wires, cables, and harnesses. It allows create the cabling automatically on the base of the virtual channels. The channel may have complex geometry, including splines, and can have many endpoints and interconnections. To create new harness in Space Cable, go to Harness tab and click Create New button. Enter name for harness and click OK. Harness assembly includes some sub-assembly such as container, channels, connectors and other. I prepared demo model which already have connectors and fixtures, but these components should be placed into active harness assembly. So I move all connectors and fixtures into appropriate assemblies in Harness Tree in Structure Browser. Spline Channel Editor is a complex tool in Space Cable which contains different commands for creation and modifying channels. To start work with channel, go to Auto tab and click Create button in the channel group. The dialog box of Spline Channel Editor opens. First tab Create contains commands for channel creation. Point to point method from a to connector method. It means creation channel from connector or leads existing channel to connector. Split channel method. It means creation channel from point in existing channel by splitting spline. Through guide method. It means leading channel through guides. Straight line method. It means creation channel like a sequence of straight segments. Tab create have some miscellaneous commands. Show or hide interpolation points in the channel. Show or hide 3D copula tool. Check box show solids. Show solid channel when it checked or curve without cover otherwise. Second tab of spline channel editor is modify contains commands for modifying and moving channels, guides, and connectors. In Edge Modification group, placed commands for working with channel. Insert interpolation point into channel. Move interpolation point. Modification modes. New position. Move interpolation point to object in new position. On face. Move interpolation point on face. Pole star. Move point in air dynamically. Interguide. Insert channel interguide. Release guide. Bring out channel from guide. On the bottom of modify tab, place next buttons. Delete segment of channel. Delete interpolation point in channel. Assign tangency at an interpolation point on the channel. Delete tangency from point. Third tab of Spline Channel Editor is Guides. Contains commands for creation and pontification guides. There are five methods of creation guides. Along pipe, create guides along pipe on surface. Through hole, Create guides through holes in existing part. On face, create guides on surfaces of existing part. Two points, create guides by specifying start and end points. On 2D line, create guides on 2D line. Fourth tab of Spline Channel Editor contains miscellaneous commands. Color definition for solid cover of channel. Diameter text box defines diameter of solid cover. Buttons height show heights or show defined channel curve in the viewport. Show only 
shows only selected object, connector or guide with channel in viewport. In left lower corner in miscellaneous tab, place commands for creation work planes. 2D geometry group contains commands for creation 2D geometry and construction lines on work planes. Fifth tab of spline channel editor is Modi 2, contains commands for modifying channel curve. There are two types of operation in this tab, tangency and merge. Tangency changes the direction of tangent vector at the curve. Merge merge segments in one curve. This command can apply it as for connection to segments with a gap between and for merge a splitted segment to one single segment. Settings tab is intended to quick search of components into harnesses. Start channel from connector. Then I want to lay channel on face. But it will be better to use guide in this case. Let's create guide on face. I can rotate it on desired angle and change position. Then continue channel a straight line. Specify start and end point for segment. Route channel further through fixtures. I back to guide stop and create guide on face again. Make copies of created guide and move it on face. The most relevant decision when I laid whole channel through guides first to the end point and then add branch to connector by splitting channel in point. When channel goes through guides or fixtures which already have channel inside, space cable suggests choose new position for channel, because two channel cannot lay together in one point.
If channel hanging in air, we can put it into guide. Click channel button and select channel. Choose into guide mode. Specify channel again and specify guide. Sometimes channel lays with a big curve and it looks not nice. In this case, we can try to fix it using commands from Modi to Tab. Select spline which need to change tangency as first curve, then select target curve. In result, it looks better.